The Deluxe Freeze Alarm provides affordable protection for your home or cabin from damage caused by frozen burst pipes as a result of furnace failure or failed air conditioning. It simply plugs into an existing telephone jack and calls up to three phone numbers with a voice alert that temperatures are either too low or too high at your home or cabin. Your freeze alarm comes with a temperature sensor, telephone cord, power cord, and instruction manual that details setup and operation. To complete the setup of your freeze alarm, you will also need a 9 volt battery. This is not included with your freeze alarm. A surge protector for power and phone line is also recommended for protection against lightning, but not required. The dip switches located on the back of the unit allow you to select various features. They have been positioned for you by our factory to the most popular settings. Switch 1 should be set in the down position for touch tone phone operation. If you are certain that your phone service uses older pulse dial technology, set the switch in the up position. Switch 2 selects the power monitoring feature. It is factory set in the down position, which activates the power monitoring feature. Some users choose not to monitor for power outages. Setting the switch in the up position disables the power monitoring feature. Switch 3 selects the frequency of the alarm callout. It is factory set in the down position to call out every 15 minutes upon alarm. Setting the switch in the up position will cause the unit to call out every two hours upon alarm. Switch 4 selects the number of rings the unit will generate before terminating the call and dialing the next programmed alarm callout number. It is factory set in the down position to wait 10 rings before trying the next number. If the switch is set in the up position, the unit will wait 3 rings. Switch 5 determines the response time between a temperature alarm and the alarm callout. It is factory set in the down position to call out immediately upon temperature alarm. If the switch is set in the up position, the unit will delay 45 minutes before calling out. Switch 6 selects Fahrenheit or Celsius operation. It is factory set in the down position for Fahrenheit operation. If the switch is set in the up position, the unit will change to Celsius operation. Before proceeding with the setup, make sure the power switch on the front of the unit is set in the standby position. Insert the power cord into the back of your freeze alarm. Then plug the other end into a wall electrical outlet. Next, insert a 9 volt battery into the battery clip located at the back of the unit. Then insert the temperature sensor connector into the back of the unit. Finally, connect the phone cord from the back of the unit to a phone wall jack or into a surge protector if you're using one. The freeze alarm requires a touch tone phone for programming. Begin by plugging a touchtone phone into the front of the unit. Now listen and choose from the following voice guided menu options to complete the programming of your unit. Menu option 1 allows you to program up to three call out telephone numbers. Menu option 2 allows you to program the temperature alarm set points. Menu option 3 allows you to program the security code. 
Menu option 4 allows you to program the number of rings before the unit answers. If you are using an answering machine, this number should be set 2 to 3 rings above the answering machine's ring setting. Menu option 5 allows you to program the number of minutes the power is out before the unit calls with an alarm message. Menu option 6 allows you to record a custom greeting and alarm message. Menu option 7 allows you to select whether the auxiliary input alarm calls out upon contact closure or upon contact opening. The auxiliary alarm input on the back of the deluxe freeze alarm can be used to monitor other sensors available from protected home. Our WSO4 water sensor detects the presence of water. It can be placed directly on the floor, or you can detach the sensor clip and locate it remotely in a sump or wash tub. The MASO1 motion sensor comes with a wireless control module and uses infrared technology to detect unwanted intruders. Simply connect the two-wire output from an external monitoring device to the detachable terminal blocks located at the back of the unit. Once you've finished programming your freeze alarm, remove the phone cord from the front of the unit. Set the switch on the front of the unit to the on position. Your freeze alarm is now ready to monitor your home or cabin. Another important feature of the Deluxe Freeze Alarm is the ability to switch from one thermostat to a different thermostat with a lower or higher temperature setting. This enables you to call ahead and warm up your cabin before you arrive. This option should be installed by a licensed heating and air conditioning or electrical contractor. It is important to verify that you have programmed your callout telephone numbers properly. To conduct a callout test, disconnect the temperature sensor from the back of the unit for 5 seconds, then reconnect. This will cause the freeze alarm to begin its alarm callout sequence. Have a person at the receiving end available to answer the alarm call. This verifies that the alarm callout telephone numbers have been programmed properly. Thank you for choosing the Deluxe Freeze Alarm from Protected Home.